Hello and welcome to the video. So in this part of the training now, we are going to register a business. Even though we are not located in the US, but we can actually register our business in the US for us to be able to have access to start operating a Stripe account. So with a registered business like an LLC, we can start operating a Stripe account. Remember in the last video, we have registered a Payoneer account, which enabled us to have access to a bank account that we can impute into our PayPal while we are doing registration. So here on this website at inkauthority.com, we are going to set up our business, okay? It works in a very simple way, three simple ways. Choose your state, enter a business name, and then form your new LLC. Okay, so this is pretty simple. So we just start with start now for free. So basically here you're going to enter your entity type, choose the LLC, and what state you want to register. Okay, here is a very important part. Now, in some states in the United States, there are some that the tax the yearly tax average is up to $800 or less or more, sometimes more. But for this particular video, for this particular training, we're going to be using Kentucky, okay? Because the tax, the yearly tax uh, for Kentucky is very minimal, just around $15 per year, okay? So that is what we're going to choose in this part. So I'm going to look for Kentucky here. I'm going to select that, save and continue, okay? Now I'm going to enter my details here, make sure you enter your correct details, okay? I'm going to enter my details, so we'll simply choose agree. Say that continue. Okay, so I'll just enter a brief description of my business there. Yes. does not require insurance so business type I'm just gonna take online okay save and continue so I'm gonna choose address here my address to get my address I'm going to go to this other website called ship it to dot com okay to get an address so i come here i sign up so choose your membership type i'm going to choose let me start with a free account okay okay so an email has been sent to me. Let me just go and confirm that. It says please verify your account. So I'm going to confirm my email address. Okay. So we can see this is now my new address. Okay. Very easy. So I'm going to enter this inside of this place. California. My zip is 9250. 
okay save and continue now this is an important part i need this employer identification number so i'm going to choose to get this okay yes include an ein number okay then i'm going to click save and next operating agreement okay so this is also important so you need this operating agreement which is 89 bucks i click next record books on and seal okay i don't necessarily need this I'll skip that. I don't need this. I'm going to skip that. Website registration. I already have a website, so I don't need that. So I'm just going to skip that as well. Protection advisor. No. I don't need this. I'm going to skip. Okay, business account. I don't need this as well. I can say no because I already have an account, my payment account, so I just skip that. Okay. So you can see, this is my shipping address. Then I'm going to choose delivery option free. Then my billing address is going to be same as shipping address. Payment method, I'm going to put that now. And you can see my order total is 178 dollars okay so with this this is basically all i need to set up an llc so within this few minutes now you can see i'm able to um set up a business so what's going to happen is that i'm going to just wait for them to send me um the digital copy once i place the order okay and then I'm going to get digital delivery to my email. I'm also going to get the EIN further tax ID number and then the operating agreement. Okay, so those are the basic things that I actually need. So this website is actually free to use, kind of. Okay, unlike other places where you have to pay so much for this type of service. So once you are done with this now, you should be able to get your business fully registered and get your EIN ID and stuff like that all set up. So that's what we are going to now use as we are creating a Stripe account. Remember we are trying to create a business Stripe account that does not have limit, that can receive payment and that can receive payment worldwide without any cap or any restrictions so i can just go ahead and place my order that's exactly what you're going to do when you enter all this all right so that's that for this part so in the next video i'm going to show you step by step on how we're not going to set up the stripe account with our details see you in my next video